Hi everyone, my name is Johanna Söderström and my chapter Relational Peace Among Elites in Cambodia scrutinizes elite relations among domestic peace signatories as they have developed over the last 30 years. Using the relational peace framework, I wanted to contribute to two fields of research, hybrid peace and post-war elite continuity. Firstly, the peace in Cambodia is often referred to as a hybrid peace, and I found that a rather unsatisfactory labeling. So I wanted to dig deeper into what kind of peace we actually see in Cambodia. Secondly, and more importantly, research on post-war elites have been rather limited lately, uh, and mostly concerned with the world wars. But continuity of elites tends to be the defining trait, despite the upheaval of war and peace agreements. Elites stay on. Um, they have a disproportionate amount of power and influence and they shape public opinion. So it's important to understand their role in the peace. And signatories to peace agreements can take on many different roles in the peace, either undermining or supporting it. Now, the question asked in my chapter is, having signed uh, the peace agreement, how do Cambodian elites relate to their fellow peace signatories? My chapter builds on newspaper articles uh, as they allow me to study elite relations over time. Now, the material I used uh, speaks to the public representation uh, of these relations and not necessarily their true relations behind closed doors. And ultimately, not all components are reported on equally in media. In the chapter, I go into a lot of different choices I had to make about how to delimit the material uh, in order to make it manageable for analysis. In the chapter, I show, for instance, that the main diet between Prime Minister Hun Sen and the Funsinpec party leader, Rana Rid, does not qualify as relational peace, but is perhaps better termed a piece of domination as the relationship is largely about domination, distrust, and dependency. Ultimately, the relational peace framework uh, was useful for this study, uh, even if these relations did not live up to that ideal. <laughs> 